Hi there, this is 908388, um, aka Vivo, as some of you may know. Um, as you can see, I have shaved my head for my first day at uh, Vessi Leadership Academy. I know that same, some of you have received my message last Thursday, and I apologize if it's, uh, if it's too sudden for you. But I'd like to thank all of you guys to um, for those of you who actually supported me on this, and I will try to continue on. Anyways, when I first walked into the school, I gotta say it was really small, like three, it's like a gazillion times smaller than Stillwater Area High School. But the reason why the school is small is so then students can have the opportunity to talk to the teacher and communicate with them better. In a way, it's like family-oriented, if you know what I mean. The school is made up of two separate groups. Students who have a lack of behavioral issues and those of us who are actually determined to join this type of thing to help us with enlistment in the military army. <clears throat> um, and I happen to be one of those people who are really determined. And so for the required things, um, I had to buy myself a new pair of uh, tennis shoes. So I got myself black hands and sweatpants, got myself extras too. Um, the school also issued you uh, a PTA uniform. It's uh, they issue you with a, a green PTA uniform Monday. Uh, they require you to wear this like Monday through Friday. Here's my uniform. And it's, a, it's like a hooded sweatshirt as you can see. Um, as for the classes, um, pretty much they've assigned me to classes that are required for graduation. They haven't received my current grades yet. Um, which really sucks because I really want to join some of their, their electives, but even though they don't really have much, but still. Um, as for physical education, that's required no matter what. Um, they work you like a horse. Oh my goodness. Um, had a hard time keeping up with uh, some of the students there. Man, I need to get back in shape. <laughs> um, so pretty much today in physical education, all we did was just like, you know, do the drilling exercises and played kickball. And I have to admit, I suck terribly at kickball. Uh, the class, uh, most of the classes, we pretty much did worksheets. Um, as for me, I did both worksheets, reading, and free writing journal, which was really, really boring. Um, they have like a homeroom called, uh, like they have a thing called, um, where you actually have homerooms where, you know, it's a place where you actually catch up on whatever assignments that you need to do to, um, you know, required for graduation. And, um, as for the teachers, most of them are actually made up of former military people themselves. And I, I give high respects to them for that. Um, some of them, they're like, yeah, and others are like, hi, I can actually socialize with this guy. Um, yeah, most, and for the students in class, I had a hard time actually focusing in class because most of the students that are in my classes are made up of people who can't actually, I, I act like a bunch of adults, honestly. And they yell, they holler, they rude, obnoxious comments, stuff like that. And I'm actually surprised that the teachers actually put up with that. Um, yeah, but overall, I gotta say, it's somewhat disappointing to me of the whole school. Uh, I'm not saying like uh, the people are are bad. I mean, like all of them are just really nice people. They treated me like their own. But it's just like the way it's. I gotta say it's somewhat uncoordinated, and I don't know. 
But anyways, hope you guys have a nice day. Um, I will post up a video review of number two day at Fancy Leadership Academy. Uh, Vivo out. Oorah.